All right, let's start it up. And already it is time for the Sound Eclipse portion of the video. Spawning by C here. We're playing Chavez. We're not going to be near C too, too long here. We're going to head right over to D and E section. Um, uh, we'll take a second and put our hack traps down. At least that way we'll know if someone was over here. Um, yeah, we can get some intel along the way. We'll even put down on this too, but we'll make sure it's the first thing we put down. Oh, I heard a key card in there. No, I don't think I can actually leave it now. Legally speaking. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, yeah, we're in here now, I guess. Okay, well, we're playing Chavez. We got the weapon one, and it's because I think the weapon one on Chavez is, this might be a hot take, potentially better than his weapon three. The weapon three fires really slowly. It doesn't do that much more headshot damage, 60 compared to 50 on this gun, and body shot wise, it's 40 compared to 30. Like, it's not huge differences considering the... Uh, the amount of longer fire rate it takes. I haven't really run the numbers to see like mathematically which is better. I'm not going to. My vibe check says this one feels better and well, I'm going with that. <laughs> Easy. Okay. Just like we did pick up a couple things. Now we can head to the D&E section of the map. Keep an eye out for anyone looking sus. We're running this with the pretty normal Expertise 2 Passive 3, the big field that gives us resistance, and the uh, when we land shots, we heal our gray health. Um, I don't really need to follow anyone in. And it's somewhat less sus if you don't. I'm just going to hope there's two intel in here. I should have also probably gone to the other door. Okay, so no one was likely in here, given there's a key card. Two intel is exactly what I wanted. They could have gone in the other side. I don't know if there's much point in hack trapping this door. Because we'll know if they enter that door. And care too much, but just, you we just saw them time. leave. There is no vault terminal here. Okay. So, other than the reload sound just not working for <laughs> whatever reason there, we came out of that on top, to say the least. Um, I'm not sure who was who. I know we shot, I think, the red up here, and then they came down because the squire was also chasing them. They just ended up in a, like, terrible spot, like, through no fault of their own, right? Like... <laughs> Can't blame them for what happened there. They got stuck between a Chavez and a wire, both trying to kill them. Um, and then somehow we did also, I think, land headshots on the Squire. The the hit markers were red, and I was kind of surprised. I did not think I was landing headshots, but hey, we came out of that with pretty much everything you could ever want. Terminal located. It is all yours. I probably should have hack trapped that door just beforehand, but there we go. That's that's the gun. We saw it. Um, now we just run from place to place until we uh, <laughs> until the vault opens. And there's our last key card we don't have. I'm gonna grab this outfit because eventually we'll need one. I'm gonna walk terribly as I do it. And we will head to... Wait. Did we already see a bunch of these guys? I don't know. I'm going to move on, I guess. Did they follow? I moved really badly. They did turn around. 
but to sit down? I don't know. I'm not gonna overthink it. I mean, I already am, but... We're on this side of the map now. We're over here now. Just checking the scanner, see if it was active. We did see a VIP there, so could use that. All these drawers and stuff are open. Let's get us a line so I can walk really nicely. Whoop. Whoop. Just stay on the line. Okie doke. We can even we can even do a little bit of running here. Hello, people. Key card there. Doug being really annoying. There we go. I was going to say Doug's being annoying because he's holding the door open, hack trapping an open door. Or I guess a door stuck open doesn't really do much, does it? This is not gone? Looks like yeah. you have found there was a key card here. There was a XP cassette here. Also two XP cassettes. That was the last one. All right, a secret exit was not open there. At least not yet. As we're running here, I'm just hovering my expertise because if uh, someone shoots out of this, you know what? We're doing the cover break strategy. Which seemed to go pretty well because we got it instantly back again. Um, but yeah, the cover break strategy is pretty much exactly what it sounds like. You just run until your cover breaks and you just keep going. Because the idea is you get far enough that you don't really need uh, you don't really need your cover. You just run to the printer and find one. But obviously, I mean, we kind of did it there. We barely slowed down. I uh, just near the end when I was looking for a printer. And, uh, well... We saw the results. I should have hacked trapped a couple more doors on the way. That seemed odd. Hang on. Oh. Make sure we keep backing up on them. It is important to backpedal when we're fighting Flutori. If, you know, as much as you really can. Because, uh, uh, you know, oh no, we did get intel from killing Flutori there. Um, because obviously they want to get at you and sword swipe you. And on the flip side, when you're playing Sasori, you really want to be sprinting and shooting if you can, because you can do that and no one else can't. So you always catch people and get in sword range. There we go. There's our, there's our tips. And just gonna head on up as quick as we can. Oh. They're putting down tripwires. Hang on. Oh boy. Okay, good start. Please reload. My reload is silent right now. I don't know why my reload is silent, but it's throwing me off just a little bit. That was pretty good against that cap. I again, I'm trying to think if any of these fights would have been real different with weapon three. Uh, I think on the Sasori, I'm not gonna say we won like max fire rate, but um, yeah, that one was probably the only one. So maybe the fire rate doesn't matter as much as I thought. Because if we were only firing a shot, if we were firing weapon one at the speed we're firing weapon three, then obviously the bonus damage is worth it. It's just a matter of whether that was the case, and I don't know. <laughs> the answer is I don't know, but I like this gun. And there we go. A sound eclipse victory. We took some people out this game. I'm kind of impressed with our performance, not gonna lie. I mean, the red the, the red was just in a rough situation. Um, maybe we don't count that one, but the Squire, we had full health. The Sasori, we missed like a shot or two. The Cav, we did okay. Like we did some, we did some good fights. Let's see if we can keep it up in game two, and I will see you guys right there. Let's just chill for a sec.
There we go. Oh, right. It's time for the sound eclipse portion of the... Oh, wait a minute. Uh, I think we just did this. Anyway, let's get going on to... Looks like a green room. Might as well start here since we started here if we can. Um, ah, could have reacted a little fast on that one. Oh, you know what? Thanks, Carlos. I want you to know, I appreciate you. I don't care what Wendy says behind your back, I appreciate you. And the blue is a great grab from there. And I don't think it's even worth it. You know what? There we go. We hack drafted. Was it worth? Uh, who can say? These guards. I'm a key Close grade. that back up. Fits in my pocket. I think we're gonna go to A. Towards A. And we'll do it. I didn't need to open that, but now that we're invested, we'll do it this way. I won Madam Ping. Two Madam Ping. Is that right? Good to know. I saw a couple Madams in the lobby, and that tells us there's at least two of them, and they both have beat three. Okay, eight intel. I'd waste kind of a bunch of time. So if that was A that just went off gonna be in some trouble. Um, I still hear a key card, which usually means nobody was here before us. Which is kind of worrying for its own reasons, because I mean someone will probably show up while we're here. If we could get 8 intel, we can't. Um... Let's go out the store. There's usually one right here. I got it already. Did I open the drawer? Yep. Did I check here? Nope. Can I get one more? I can. Funky. Let's allow us to do this. Just like and that works out to be exactly eight. If I stand here and do this and this, we can use the third person camera and hold it just like that and take a little look down the stairs. Congratulations, okay. you have found a vault terminal. Wanted to make sure that one dog wasn't about to shoot us, and if they were, we would be looking at them when they did. Okay, there's you another one Madam Ping. Second Madam Ping means they're both still alive. Come. Work. Just keeping track of these little things can be helpful. Splash, splash, and Updating take, we'll take the line to B. Okay, kind of quiet game. Um, there was one staff member that way that looked quite sus, but I can't, I wasn't going to shoot them and they were really far away. They could have also just been like dodging NPCs, so it's really hard to call them out. I didn't hack trap the door. I need like a buzzer or something <laughs> every time I open a door. Better luck elsewhere, oh. agent. No vault terminal here. Better luck. This is exactly what I was looking for. This is great for me, actually, except for the lack of fights so far. Considering we went to A and B. Yeah, no, there was, there was no way I was just about to shoot Hazen like that. Uh, even if that was a player, I was I was getting shot first. That was not going to happen. I don't even mind that he's, like, scolding me right now, because, like, they're not coming in. I'm just gathering up the rest of my intel. He still has to be pretty close to actually build your heat with the scold, so we can get away with this pretty easily. There we go. Okay, that, that's not a player Doug, that's just a VIP Doug, which are... <laughs> the VIP guards are now the most sus NPCs 
because they're trying to get to a moving point and it just they just they just kind of break <laughs> um, and they look exactly like how players move Nothing to see here. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> Three Robs in the same area? Time to not be here. Four? Wait. Four is too many. Um. No. What about the one I took my disguise from? Um. I just got get down, Mr. President. It's super hard. And now. Okay. You know what? We'll sit here. I feel like there's a player who looks exactly like me who just walked past me. Because there's not that many elite mobs around. But maybe I'm wrong. Also, we have heat now, so I don't know. We're not going to be able to do anything about it. Do not be alarmed, but arrival has deactivated a vault terminal. Okay, well, we're here. Ah, someone picked him up. The vault's open. Time to get down to business. We still have heat, so... Well, I attempted to invent some excitement for phase one, but just wasn't having it. Um, should be hack trapping doors. I think we are going to take a second and do that. We'll put one here. And one on the mirroring side over here. Ooh, we got to slow down for a sec, though. These are probably by far the two most common doors. All right, we at least got six down now. I didn't do the door I came in, which was obviously a mistake, but... What are the odds someone came the exact route I did? We got all the other ones. Okay. Okay. Seeing anything overly sus. My key to success. Okay, I guess no one's seeing. Never mind. Ah. That sucks. Dang, that sucks. I also didn't get to count how many madams were still alive. They changed the skies. Nice gig, they could have pinged, but I think they were them. I don't have any neutralize. They snapped. Shoot. Did they snap back or snap into somebody? Snap back. Which was like a good move, but they've run into the other madam? No, what is my aim? That hits. That hits. That doesn't. Oh my god, it's like firing at spaghetti. <laughs> She's so narrow. Ay, ay, ay. She snapped back. And I'm just gaining heat here. 
If it's food, I'll be okay. It's just the heat's gonna probably get me killed. Oh, come on, stop shooting me. I need to just get cover back, lose heat, change the skies. Simple three step plan. Might as well do some work. Yeah, having heat level two for this is not gonna be good, but hopefully they continue to be somewhat scared. We don't really, really have to react until, uh... Until they're on the point. I can, I can lose heat this whole time. Extraction vehicle has arrived. Yeah. They are getting away. I'm just losing heat. It's just good for me. Okay, heat's lost. Um, shoot, I don't know if there was that person in yellow right there. It was not. <laughs> I gotta watch for the snapback. We know this madam likes to do that. Ugh, I think I still make it. Barely. Oh, they stepped off. Or snapped off. Presumably stepped? I don't know. We gotta be here for the whole losing extraction progress, though. Gained heat again. Okay, and cover and health. Oh, we finally landed the shots we needed. Jeez, it was rough for a while, and then we just snapped two headshots off. Like, what? I mean, we played exactly how we needed to, which, like, was a great showing. I think, did we only get the one kill in the end? <laughs> I think it was a really good showing of how to play. I mean, if I had to just hit a lot of the shots when we were in the vault, none of that would have happened. But <laughs> I think it was a really good showing of here's what we got to do against Madam in this situation. So despite only having one Elim, it was the important Elim, and I think we showed off some good play, so. Also, how often do we get double sound eclipse? Like, come on. <laughs> Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed. That was kind of stressful at the end. I wasn't sure we were going to make it when I was not landing shots, and then we just snapped two headshots, and I was like, oh, that's it. Okay. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Do like the video if you did. Comment any thoughts as always, and subscribe for deceiving content like this in the future, and I will see you in the next one.